in honor of the first JoJo Friday of part five. <laughs> Remember at the beginning of part 3 when Dio appears in the coffin Arena took to escape at the end of part 1? Remember that time Dio was able to make animal-human hybrids and never did again? Remember how Dio completely gave up on using a vampire army or even any of his vampiric abilities for all of part 3? Remember how Dio barely knew what an automobile was yet somehow managed to travel the world and have 4 kids after he was freed from his coffin? Remember how one of Dio's minions stand is literally the sun, which is the biggest weakness to a vampire? Remember how scary monsters dino aids were used all of like twice and then never again? Remember that time when Kakyoin was able to damage enemies using paintings and it was never seen again? Remember how no one can just deflect the emerald splash? No one can just deflect the emerald splash. No one can just deflect no one the emerald just splash. Deflect the emerald no one splash. can just deflect the emerald splash. No one can just no one can just deflect, 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 deflect the emerald splash. Remember how Josuke saving himself was set up for bites the dust, but it was never seen in that arc? Remember that time when Gold Experience's life shot accelerated an opponent's mind faster than their body? and it was never seen again. Remember how Starfinger was a thing for all of two fights, and never seen again? Remember when Heaven's Door needed someone to see the manga Pink Dark Boy for Rohan to control them, and it was never seen again? Remember when Jotaro and Polnareff were looking for stand arrows in 1990, but Jotaro didn't even know about the bow and arrow until Morio in 1999? Remember Fugo, before Purple Haze feedback? Remember King Crimson? It just works. Remember how Planet Waves was originally named Earth, Wind, and Fire because he forgot about Mikitaka? Remember how Joseph's Hermit Purple could have been used to at least help find Kira and Morio? Remember how Jotaro's time stop was two seconds throughout all of part four and six, but somehow increased to five seconds for the finale of part six? Yada yada. Remember how Josuke could use bubbles to steal abstract things like eyesight? until he just doesn't? Remember when Anasui had tits? Remember Dio's magic cripple healing powers from part 6 that were never seen before or after? Yeah, Johnny really could have used that. Remember how Sandman is called Soundman several times because he literally just forgot his name? Remember how Smokey was set up to be Joseph's sidekick at the beginning of part 2 and was never seen until the end? Remember how androgynous hot pants looked until Johnny stole second base? Remember that kid Gyro tried so hard to save? He just up and died. Remember Emporio's origins? Remember how the green baby was supposed to be a setup for how Dio would be resurrected? But then the end of part 6 happened? Remember how Jotaro saves Joseph at the end of part 3 after he dies, and then tells Josuke at the beginning of part 4 that there's nothing a stand can do to save someone that's already dead, and then Giorno managed to Lazarus Bushilati through half of part 5. Remember that Diver Down is literally just a punching ghost, and its ability doesn't pertain to the stand itself. Remember when Straitso wanted to kill Joseph and Arena to stop the spread of Haman users? But then trained Lisa Lisa and gave her the Red Stone of Aja? Remember in the Steely Dan arc when stands are just able to shrink themselves and it's never seen or used again? Remember when stands are first introduced they're connected to the breathing of a person, kind of like Hamon, but that's kind of discarded, like, immediately? Remember how Silver Chariot can shed all of its armor and only does it twice? in not really important fights? Remember how Yuya never used his great sense of smell to help find Kira? Remember how Josuke's healing ability doesn't quite fix things perfectly until it just does? Remember when Speedwagon could just heat up his abs so hot they could melt Dio's ice? Remember original Josuke and Iggy? Remember how Johnny was always able to shoot nail bullets from his toes but just didn't? Remember when Dio said Hermit Purple was the weakest stand? but he also said Survivor was the weakest stand? Remember how Cream Starter can exist in other realities without hot pants? Remember when he forgot how birthmarks work? Remember how old Joseph goes to Japan to meet a woman he had an affair with and returns to America with a baby? Remember when he forgot how snails work? And the worst one of all. Remember when Araki forgot how to write character arcs and just gave up with cohesion? Let's be glad that Araki didn't forget to release part five.
無駄無駄。